What's up guys? Tim from Olson Motor Sports. Super excited about today. We have the Virus, is that how you say it? Virus or Virus? Virus. I think it's Virus. Engineering Swan Neck Wing. Yeah. He's going to show you a shot of a real Swan Neck Wing over there in a second. That were that inspired the idea. But it's going on this Cayman R. The guys at Virus are super awesome. We used some of their products before on a Subaru. We used their Subaru rear trailing arm kit and I was super impressed with the fit, how it was well thought out, all the brackets work. So we decided to give them a shot on this and it just showed up. Where's my OSHA? Approved cutting device. And I wanna take a look at this and see. So it is, it is carbon. And this kit includes the wing and the base. I think this is the airfoil. Here. Well packaged. That's probably installation instructions, which we're not going to read. And then they have a gurney here, which I think you can configure the gurney to any size you want. This looks like a, an 18 or a 20 mil. Not carbon, obviously. So I'll set this up right here. That's probably end plates, which I'm super excited about because they're completely uh, configurable from the drawings. I've not seen this in person. This is I've just seen drawings. We got to do this really fast because Turbo's hiding right now. If he comes back and sees all this cardboard, he's gonna go lose his mind. Yeah. It's very nicely done. Multiple wing angle mounts here to get the proper wing angle that we need. And then this mounts like a cup car. So the gurney, you could probably interchange it, but it's just designed to go down with double-sided tape. So they don't have a slot to change on that. That's going to be super, super awesome. Yeah, that's how the gurney would fit. And then they actually include, I mean, the carbon is beautiful. It's like Porsche grade. Porsche grade carbon. This, this is a beautiful piece. So I'm going to set this off to the side and then grab the, this should be the wing base and the uprights. Here's hardware pack. And there's the double sided tape for the gurney. Hardware pack, all the nuts, washers, stainless. We'll open that in a second. So we're going to do an install video on this wing as well. So I've, I've been carbon fiber guy for many, many, many years. And for non-Porsche carbon, this is spectacular. But usually when you get, usually when you get carbon, especially straight out of a mold and not super finished, usually you want to paint it because you know, you see the edges. This is, this is absolutely perfect. So Keith will do a close up of this and then I have a 991 RSR. We'll show you the carbon that this is right next to the uh, latest RSR, GT Lamar car. And it looks, it looks 
just as good as that. Um, so this is designed to go in this car, right where the factory wing is located. And then it'll mount on the car like this, and the wing will bolt up to it. So these are hard coat anodized. I think it's 6061, hard coat anodized. We'll get it on the car. So we're gonna make another YouTube video as well. Thanks to the guys at Verus. Um, we're gonna make another YouTube video as well of the install um, on this car. The only thing I wish is I wish this wing was dry carbon. You know, instead of the gloss. They finished the, the that and gloss. It'd been nice to see a dry carbon as well. That was an option, but in the amount of time that we had to, to pull this project together, it just it just wasn't available uh, in stock and ready to ship. So um, we'll get this on the car. We'll make a short YouTube video on how to install it and then some before and after shots of it. Thanks for watching.